Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of months ago, Microsoft introduced the new Bing search with the chatbot ChatGPT integration, calling it the new Bing, as I have been posting. And this got quite a lot of attention, and there was quite a lot of hype regarding the um, rollout um, of the new Bing chat a couple of months ago. And with Microsoft saying themselves, um, as I mentioned previously, that within the first month of the new Bing chat rolling out, that they received um, that basically 100 million users did sign up to join that waiting list and get the new Bing chat. And uh, um, in regards to um, the different search engines and the new Bing chat and even Google's BARD, uh, StatCounter has recently uh, posted a recent survey, which is very interesting when it comes to the actual uh, percentages worldwide for the different search engines and some interesting results came out of that survey now just a quick recap stat counter as many of you may know and as i do post and um, they uh, roll out these different surveys regarding um as an example uh the windows um market share worldwide windows version market share worldwide you get the desktop browser market share worldwide and i do post on those so I thought this would be interesting just to take a look at their April 2023 search engine market share worldwide, as this has been covered in the media. And uh, just to kind of put things into perspective when it comes to a good guesstimate when it comes to the actual market share. And yeah, we can see um, Bing. I would have thought personally that this would have been a lot more up the ladder, so to speak, when it comes to its market share, but nonetheless, not to be, according to StatCounter. And just on a side note, once again, um, these surveys done by different companies, as I always mention, um, are never 100% accurate. Um, so just take that into consideration, although they do kind of give or take, give us a good indication. Now, starting here in sixth place, Baidu, 0.44%. Moving on just a little bit further up the ladder, DuckDuckGo, 0.52%, Yahoo, 1.1%, Yandex, 1.65%, and I really would have thought Bing, with all this um, kind of hype with the um, new chatbot integration and so on, the new Bing search and the new Bing chat, this would have been a lot further um, in regards to its percentages, only 2.79%, and very similar to the desktop browser market share with Chrome and Edge. Google way out in front with 92.61%. And that's uh, even um, considering that Google with their chatbot, Google Bard, which um, hasn't got that much attention and is basically in its infancy compared to the new Bing chat. Um, even though Google Bard kind of isn't really rolling out as it should be compared to the new Bing, um, obviously the um, Google search engine way out in front still very dominant uh, in its market share. And if we head to the chart provided, uh, Bing here in the powder blue at the bottom and uh, Google right here at the top uh, in the kind of dark red orange, you can see once again, this gives us a good idea way out in front. So um, although the uh, new Bing uh, chat and the new Bing has received quite a lot of attention, according to StatCounter, not nearly as close as I thought it would be to the... Um, Google search engine and that's this is going to be an interesting one to watch in the future uh, where this actually ends up especially now that um, Google is making its uh, chatbot uh, Google Bard more widely available which I have been posting on and um, we'll get into that in another video and uh, maybe later on in the day but just wanted to bring this to your attention being 2.79 percent way behind compared to the Google search engine. And I thought that was interesting and just puts things into perspective regarding the so-called chatbot wars and whatever that I have been posting on over the last couple of months. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.